The term hydraulic separation describes a situation where deep groundwater is not connected to shallow groundwater. This is important to the safety of a GDF because groundwater movement is one of the ways in which radioactive materials may potentially move to surface. In the UK, we don't have much information about the composition of groundwater at depth. That information that we do have tells us that deep groundwater is salty and stagnant when compared to shallower groundwater. And this is particularly the case when the shallow and deep groundwater are separated by a clay-rich layer of rock, which creates a barrier to movement of groundwater between the two. I'm going to use these gravel-filled glasses to demonstrate. This glass contains gravel. When I pour the coloured water in, it fills the full depth of the glass in between the pore spaces. When we pour water into this glass, the clay layer acts as a barrier, preventing the water going into the lower layer of gravel. And this is a demonstration of hydraulic separation. So whilst we have very little information regarding the composition of groundwater at depth, we can use the presence of clay-rich layers to guide us as to where hydraulic separation may exist. We can then use boreholes to identify clay-rich layers that are capable of causing hydraulic separation.